While we're all trying to prevent the spread of COVID-19, it's important to know that even if you're exposed to the virus, you might not get infected if your immune system is strong enough. Here are 10 things you can do to boost your immune system to help your body fight off the virus and survive it even if you get infected. Hi, this is Dr. Shintani for your health. Please help to spread the word by subscribing to this channel and send a link to your family and friends so they can protect themselves against the virus too. It's important to know that to date there's no known cure for COVID-19, at least for now. But think about it. When the flu or cold season comes around, don't you notice that some people catch it and some people don't? This is largely because some people have immune systems that are strong enough to resist infections. There are things you can do so that you too can boost your immune system to protect yourself from COVID-19. Here are 10 things you can do to boost your immune system. Number one, eat colorful vegetables and fruit. Probably the best thing you can do overall is to eat lots of colorful vegetables and fruit. These foods are loaded with vitamins, minerals, bioflavonoids, carotenoids, anthocyanins, catechins, and numerous nutrients that support a strong and robust immune system. Number two, avoid things that burden the immune system. Smoking, vaping, alcohol, toxins, processed foods, GMO foods, chemicals, anything that is toxic or foreign to the body will tax your immune system and make it less able to fight off viruses. So stop doing those things that may weaken your immunity. Number three, exercise. Exercise is important because it wakes up your immune system to fight off infections. It also improves circulation so that white blood cells can get to invasive organisms more efficiently and destroy them before they take hold. Research points out that moderate exercise reduces the risk and severity of respiratory viral infections, but don't overdo it. Too much exercise can suppress your immune system. Number four, sleep. We also know that sleep can affect your ability to ward off viral infections. Research indicates that a proper amount of sleep, around seven to eight hours, supports the immune system and will reduce the risk of the common cold. Number five, vitamin D. A major global study indicates that vitamin D can protect people from viral respiratory infections. It appears that vitamin D helps to enhance the immune system's ability to ward off viruses. Remember that vitamin D can be enhanced with not just supplements, but also with moderate exposure to sunlight. Number six, vitamin C. Vitamin C has long been recommended for the treatment of the common cold. While it doesn't appear to prevent the colds, it appears to reduce the symptoms. In various studies, the use of 1,000 milligrams to 3,000 milligrams per day have been used. The use of IV vitamin C is also promising, but not adequately tested in preventing viral infections. Number seven, zinc. Zinc has long been used to reduce the symptoms of the common cold. Although studies have been mixed as to whether it really helps, it's clear that zinc deficiency is associated with increased susceptibility to the H1N1 flu. So it seems prudent to take enough zinc to keep your immune system strong. Just be aware that you should not use zinc intranasally because it can actually destroy your sense of smell. Number eight, garlic. In randomized, double-blind, placebo-controlled trials, garlic was shown to reduce the severity of cold and flu symptoms. Number nine, elderberry. Elderberry is a folk medicine for the treatment of the flu. In modern times, a randomized study of the efficacy of elderberry extract, patients taking 15 milliliters of elderberry extract found that their symptoms were relieved in an average of four days earlier than those who were on placebo. Number 10, ginger. Researchers from Japan found that ginger extract can inhibit viral replication. It also found that allicin, which is found in ginger, as well as onions, have the ability to inhibit the binding capacity of viruses and thus is likely to prevent influenza 
and other respiratory viruses, and possibly COVID-19. So try these 10 things to boost your immune system to give yourself the best chance to resist the coronavirus. Please share this and our other COVID-19 videos on this channel at AskDrShintani.com so that your friends and family and all of us can stay healthy together and prevent the spread of the coronavirus. This is Dr. Shintani for your health.